Welcome to What's Cooking. Today we're cooking a basic cheese pizza on the Unicoda pizza oven in under 100 seconds. I recommend the semolina and the Unicoda, it handles the heat much better. Uni has a downloadable app. I'm using the 60% hydration and 280 balls. Make an eight of them, copy it down, download the app. I toss the uh, ball down on the semolina and I try to do the best to make it the perfect shape. That doesn't always happen. This is what's cooking. Hit the bell notification and please subscribe. As you can see, easy back and forth, back and forth. You gotta stop every once in a while and just readjust it. Eventually you will get the shape and size that you're looking for. I tend to make larger pizza balls at 280 grams. So this is gonna be right about the maximum size pizza that you can put into this oven. I really used to spend a lot of time making the perfect pie. And after I've done a few of these, I realize that no matter what it looks like, it's all going to come out the same. This is going to rise. I like to use the Rio's homemade tomato basil sauce. It's made from the Samarano tomatoes. It tastes great right out of the can. It's a little expensive. You can use anything you want. It's what I choose. Works for me. Doing the cheese pizza today. Nothing special. I'm using bagged mozzarella that I bought in a big bag over at uh, BJ's Wholesale. I'm pretty liberal with it. like to put a lot down. Get it all over the place. Make sure that I cover every square inch or the kids won't eat it. This pie is ready to put in the oven. I would recommend using a metal peel. The wooden peels, they tend to get burnt a little in the tip when you use those, so I would stay clear of them is my recommendation. Also, if you put plenty of semolina or, or you know flour underneath there, it makes it much easier to lift up when you're using that peel. Try to do it fast and quick. There we go. Look at that. One handed. Now we start the clock. The goal here is to get this pizza done in under 100 seconds. It's pretty easy. The oven gets about uh, 900 degrees at some points. The base is generally about 600 if you let it warm up after you start it. Usually around 25 30 seconds, you need to pull it out the first time and make the turn. Five, and let's take it out and take a look. Again, nice, cr nice crust rise on the edges. It's not burnt. And then after the first 30 seconds, you kind of have to go in and turn it a little more because you have to remember the bottom of that pizza is already starting to cook. So unless you want it to burn, you got to flip it around a little more often once you make that initial turn. Some people get away with doing three turns. I kind of tend to like to take it in and out a little more. I feel like I have better control. I could have probably got this one down in 90 seconds, but uh, the sun does not like burnt cheese pizza. <laughs> and we got 10 seconds left to go. Five, four, three, two, one, and we're done. Perfect cheese pizza for any 10 year old boy. I'll be cooking something a little more exciting for myself in the next video. Please hit the bell notification, subscribe, and like. And thank you for watching What's Cooking.